All right, so this is my, I guess I could call it a vlog, just kind of a, um, an entry tonight. So just, uh, I had some people asking me, what is it like to experience artificial telepathy? Now, if you don't know, artificial telepathy is the reading of thoughts with technology, an implantation of the replies. So essentially a technologically induced, completely, completely, um, oh, what is the word that I'm looking for here? Um, completely artificial dialogue. So now generally artificial telepathy is done with a microchip implant that is placed somewhere in the skull. Um, sometimes it's um, sometimes it's down here, sometimes it's here somewhere. Usually not in the face because that's kind of obvious. Um, so mine is actually uh, right here. And um, when people ask, you know, what is that like? You know, obviously it's not up to me. It's obviously up to the technicians and the scientists that had this implanted in me when I was in the hospital, um, when I was 17 with the flu and with a, um, oh goodness, adenovirus, norovirus. Um, essentially they had to put me under. Um, they gave me a hardcore antibiotics and um, I woke up feeling quite strange. Um, not a whole lot had changed, but there it was. So um, I wasn't activated until just recently, but um, basically the experience with artificial telepathy is hearing voices, having conversations um, in one's own head with personalities that are not their own. Um, so what makes this any different from a mental illness like schizophrenia? or from perhaps uh, an anxiety attack, or just from the imagination. Um, the real difference is that um, the voices are there from um, waking up to going to sleep pretty much more or less every day, um, all the time, talking to people, um, now, a lot of it, a lot of it is poorly understood. So, um, when I think a thought, when it, when a thought is there in my head, um, there's a translation process. So the microchip that is in my skull reads my brain waves. It reads that input. It is designed. It's a very small MRI scanner. Not, not even an MRI, it's not even that complex. It just reads the electrical output from a certain part of my brain very accurately. And then it interprets that into being, oh, what thoughts am I about to say? So there's also a microphone that was implanted right, you can't, you can't really see it, but uh, it's definitely a small lump. It's not a part of my Adam's apple. Um, but it can hear everything. And so that microphone goes along with the microchip and it says, okay, so he just said this and he was thinking this at the same time he said it. So that thought translates to uh, these words and eventually it just gets more and more accurate and it learns that this brain state leads to this type of emotion, this type of activity, this word. So what is it like to be hearing a conversation with people that also have these implants. You know, obviously it's plugged into a, a larger mainframe that I have absolutely no control over. But what is it like? Well, it's like you're around a bunch of people, a bunch of um, a bunch of people all the time. Um, some friends, some enemies. Um, you know, some of them have very strong opinions, some of them don't have very strong opinions. Um, it's just like meeting a constant flow of people from the time you wake up, even, even before you wake up, while you're sleeping too, all the time. 
Um, it's interesting. It can be uncomfortable at times. It takes a lot of getting used to. But it's happening. I didn't ask for it. It was it was forced upon me and I've had to accept it. Just like all of us accept that we are confined to our bodies when we're born. We have to accept that sooner or later or we'll go crazy. I have to accept that I experience telepathy through the use of technology. That's a part of who I am now. So, if you have any questions, comments, concerns, anything, just please feel free to leave a comment. If you like the video, leave a comment as well. Feel free to shoot me a message if you uh, have any have any qualms or anything to uh, anything to any feedback. Any feedback of any kind is greatly uh, very much welcomed. Thanks for watching. If you made it this far, uh, kind of a ramble, but authenticity is the most important thing to me. So definitely, uh, thanks for watching. Have a good day.